tonight in Orlando. It's about the victims and uniting the community in the wake of this tragedy. Our coverage begins with Channel 4's Nicole Snyder, who was there tonight as hundreds of students mourned the lives lost. Nicole. Mary, that vigil wrapped up just about 45 minutes ago. It was supposed to be held outside here where you see some people cleaning up, but because of the weather, it got moved inside to the student union, but it didn't stop hundreds of people from coming out to honor and remember those victims lost in this attack. And although it was a very emotional vigil, it was also one of peace and hope that something good will turn out out of all of this. We're all one person. It's, you know, one falls, everybody, every, it hits everybody. Even, you don't have to know, you don't have to know these people to, uh, to feel it in your heart. A range of emotions fill the student union at the University of Central Florida. Students and community members all enduring the pain of the horrific attack at Pulse. Even those who do not directly know the victims, they are standing behind those who need support and love. We just wanted to bring hope to the darkness and kind of just give people just kind of joy, whether it be a, a shoulder to cry on. Speakers talk to their fellow classmates and neighbors about how the shooting has affected everyone in Orlando and also across the world. And while the room was filled with sorrow and grief for all the beautiful innocent lives lost, there is a sense of pride and peace that something positive will come out of an act so hateful. There are a lot of people here that were lost. There are a lot of families here that they need support. And I want to be a part of that. I want to be there for those people. And the UCF community is banding together to help those affected by this attack. They've had blood drives on campus all week that will continue. And also they've been collecting stuffed animals for the children of those victims. And of course, counseling services are also available to those affected by this attack. For now, reporting live in Orlando, Nicole Snyder, Channel 4, The Local Station.